Is your Wi-Fi not performing as it should? Is your connection dropping out? Or maybe the range isn't as far as you would have hoped? Or is it just that the speeds aren't quite as fast as you were expecting, even taking into account the difference between a wired connection and a Wi-Fi one? Well, in this video, we'll discuss what you can do to get the most out of your Wi-Fi service. So the first thing that we need to check is the location of your Wi-Fi router. Is it near something electrical? Whether it's behind the TV, on top of a fridge, or maybe you've just brought down the Christmas decorations and it's by the lights. The reason I ask is electrical devices over time can start to give off electrical interference. Now, this interference will affect your Wi-Fi signal. And I go into that in a lot more detail in this video here. The other thing that's important to remember is your Wi-Fi router is actually a mini computer. So it has all these components such as your power supply and a motherboard. So should it get hot or overheat, it won't function as well as it should. Similar to if a computer or your phone overheats. So make sure that it's well ventilated and away from any windows. It's also important to consider the direction of which the Wi-Fi signal is being projected. So if we look at this router, for example, it projects the signal up and into the room. However, if I was to wall mount this router, the signal would then be projected into the room. So I may find that if I had the router in a downstairs room and I was trying to connect upstairs, my Wi-Fi signal would be stronger if the router was flat as opposed to wall mounted. If you've done these checks and you're still finding an intermittent or slow Wi-Fi connection, there are a couple more diagnostics we can do, but we need to log into the router. And I go into that in a lot more detail in this video here. So I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please click on that like button below. If you want to see more videos like this, do please click on that subscribe button. And until next time, thank you.